Aloha and greetings fellow cancer warriors and friends. I'm making a really quick video today before I head off to my next round of chemo because it's come to my attention last night in my cancer support group that there's someone who's new to our group and uh, it's a brand new experience, this whole cancer thing for her. So she has a lot of unanswered questions, of course, as we all have when we were brand new to the, to the journey. And the question was basically how to apply the lidocaine cream to your port before treatment. So I'll just say a couple of quick blurbs about it. Here is the lidocaine cream. It's a numbing cream that you can put on the port that I put on the port before I leave the house. And it takes me about an hour to drive in. And by the time I get there, it's good and numb. And you can pretty much hit me with a football and I want to feel it. <laughs> and uh, I like to use the cream because uh, why, why reinvent the wheel? Why just show up and have pain when you can simply apply a little bit of this lidocaine cream and be done with it? On, on this, so I'm just going to squeeze a little bit out right on over the port. Uh, on the rare chance that I forget, if I'm having chemo brain or blonde moment, whichever you want to call it, uh, there is a lidocaine shot I can get injected right before I have the, the chemo, but that itself burns, and this is just the easiest, most painless way to just put a little bit of cream on. You only need a, a tiny bit. I probably do overkill, but I just cover the port. I don't know if you can even see it my I, I should have showed you before I put the cream on my port is under there I call it my plug it's my lifeline keeps me alive that's where I get all my infusions um, but that's it it's easy just put a little piece of saran wrap on there notice I'm not rubbing it in so there's some tape me of course I'm using the paper tape since my skin has violent reactions to the adhesive uh, that's pretty much it I'm ready and out the door so I, I hope this video was helpful for you. Um, I will mention I have Bard Power Port. I always remember the name of it because they gave me this nifty little bracelet. <laughs> but one more quick thing to mention before I sign off here and get out the door to treatment is if any of you out there have lymphedema, it's a good idea to wear these bracelets if possible. I got this one online free many years ago that says alert lymphedema and basically instructing people not to use blood pressure, IVs, injections, anything at all on this arm because this is my arm where I had the lymph nodes taken out and it's not good to injure your arm otherwise it may swell up and cause lymphedema and then that's well, a whole nother issue right there, a bunch of problems. But So I like to put this bracelet on before I go to treatment. So if you have one of those, it's a good idea just to remind him and in case you're ever not that you should be unconscious, but in case anything ever happened in an emergency and you were unconscious, uh, you always have the bracelet on to remind them to stay off this arm. So anyway, that's it. I hope this video was helpful for you. Again, it's really easy. It saves you any pain and discomfort because they are going to stick that in pretty firm. And uh, why feel it if you don't have to? So uh, hopefully this helped you and I wish everybody the best. Aloha and God bless.